Hey, it's Cameron with SimRapMarket.com. Today I'm going to show you how to use Glitter Pattern 001 in GIMP. What I've done is I have added a file specifically for GIMP to the download for Glitter Pattern 001. Now, this is a merged file. Typically, Photoshop and Photopia users will have layered files that they will transfer into each spec map group. What I've done is I've merged this so that it's easier to use with GIMP. So I'm going to drag that file over into the custom spec map group. And because this is a merged file, you need to put it inside the spec map group, but not in one of the channels it needs to be above the channel or excuse me above the channel groups in GIMP so when you've put it in there correctly and you turn your spec map group on you should see this now from here we're going to apply the spec map pattern only to the lower red sections of this template itself so you need to select the selection tool and make sure it says sample merged. What that does is it doesn't sample an individual layer. It will sample everything that's visible. So from here, we're going to left click and hold shift and click each of these areas. Once you have that selection that you want to have the glitter pattern applied to, you're going to select the glitter pattern image layer and then from down here in the bottom right of your GIMP window you're going to have from the second to the right second from the right you're going to have a layer mask option what you'll do is you'll when you have that selection made and you have your glitter pattern layer selected you'll click that and it will apply a layer mask to that layer so that only those areas show now this little menu pops up and you want to make sure this says you have selection selected here and then click add once you've done that you can turn your spec map group on to preview the changes you've made and if done correctly you should only see the glitter pattern applied to the area that you selected then you just render the save the target to the spec map for the spec map and for the paint file itself and you should be good to go if you have any questions feel free to contact us at support at simratmarket.com or join our discord um, we've got a couple community members in there that are really helpful when it comes to uh, little issues so um, like I said if you have any questions or issues please feel free to contact us the link for the Discord is on the website in the very top. Uh, there's a blue banner at the top of the website, and you can just click that banner.